Good evening, everyone. Joe for JaspiesHobbyLand.com. 2017 Bowman's Best Baseball. Eight box. Pick your team. Number eight. Eight is great. Let's see who's aiding up this break. Ha! Two, <laughs> break eight. There it is. Kike Hernandez with Last Bot Mojo. Gabriel said that he'll pick up your hits, Kike. So thanks for getting that Last Bot Mojo. There's everyone else. All right. There's Bowman's Best. Fresh case. We've been pulling some really nice hits out of here. And if I know where... Oh, there's my knife. So let's see what other monsters we got in this one. Good luck, everybody. Now, after this... Probably have time for maybe one more break after this. I don't know what it's going to be, but that is all up to you, folks. We do have that Leaf Metal Draft. That's a guaranteed hit. That's uh, that's pretty close to filling, I think. Oh yeah, yeah, Todd. Welcome. It's. It's joke hour, by the way. Brought to you by Aquafina Water. This is your hour of bad jokes. Come for the breaks, stay for the jokes. So this is bad joke hour. And this is, this is not like bad joke as in dirty jokes. No, we're talking about safe, clean, family-friendly, cringe-worthy dad jokes. That's what we want. I had a great, uh, I had a great joke earlier. It was pretty good. Oh, is that your Thai joke, Todd? Yeah. I, oh, is Corbin a joke stealer? Uh oh. Yeah. No, I he was right up there. He was like, he's like, what is a tie used for? This? Something like that. Oh man, Gabriel, that's a good sponsor. That's a good sponsor for case breaks. We're trying to look for sponsorships. So if you're Tylenol, give us an email, jazzyshobby@gmail.com. Yeah, so with Tylenol, after after you go hitless, relieve your pain with Tylenol. See, I knew I heard that joke before. Corbin joke stealing. And from someone in the room, too, a regular. Man. Unbelievable. All right. Noah Syndergaard leads us off. These mirror cards, as you know by now, we randomize left and right. We got Helio Ramos with the Giants. That leads us off. Tyrone with the Giants. The Gigantes. Is that numbered? No, it's not. Aaron Judge. A numbered Aaron Judge card out of 250. That's nice. That goes to Mr. Brian Crouch. Cody Ballinger for the Dodgers. And P.J. Conlin, 7 out of 10 for the Mets. For Enrique Hernandez, Kike, with the New York Metropolitan's last spot mojo. Gabriel, I don't know, I guess you're out of town. Gabriel said he'll, he'll pick it up when he's in California. He said he's packing right now. And Dustin Fowler for the Yankees. Nice Dustin Fowler for Ryan Crouch and the Yankees.
And this is for Gabriel. Cody Bellinger, some value there. Jose Altuve at a 150. And there's another Aaron Judge. And Quentin Holmes for the Indians. TJ with the Tribe. Nice. Corbin, you missed your joke opportunity. You, you've, missed your, you've missed your joke opportunity earlier before the break started. No one wants, no one wants your joke on camera, on the, on the recording. They're not here for, for, for Corbin's hobby land, for the bad jokes. 51 out of 99, Buster Posey for the Giants. Tyrone with that one. All right. Where am I putting all this in this box here? Put these hits over here. All right, next box. Yeah, yeah, Corbin. They're they're tuning in for my jokes. They're gonna watch. There's they're, they're gonna watch this. They're gonna watch this recording. They'll be like, oh, I wanted Joe's jokes. Joe's bad jokes, not Corbin's bad jokes. Be like, dang. Uh, you guys, you guys, when you when you go watch a late night talk show and they get those blue cards, where do those blue cards come from? Who sells those? What color of blue is it? Why is it on a blue card? Is it easier to read? I have no idea. I'm not sure why they use that blue card. If anybody knows the secret behind that production, let me know. Where do they get those blue cards? Is there a standardized size for those blue cards? I don't know. <laughs> now, what's the deal? What's the deal? All right. Drew Ellis for the Diamondbacks. Another one for Arthur. They're blue cards. Why not use a red card? Uh, Milwaukee Brewers, Brett Phillips for the Brew Crew, Alex Donnelly. Corbin, are you just looking up these jokes? That's not, it's not fun when you look up the jokes. My urchin joke was, was written by me. I wrote that joke. I'm trying to give you guys original material. Royce Lewis for the Twins. Who's got the Twinkies in this break? EA Sports is in the break. Nice. Got an Atomic Goldschmidt for Arthur. And Dane Dunning, 33. That goes to Adam Phillips and the White Sox. Welcome back, Adam. Adam was telling us that he has not placed an order for two years. I looked it up. It's true. His last order was like in October of 2015. But he's back, folks. He's back, and he gets a hit. There you go. First hit in two years, he says. Excellent. Welcome back.
<laughs> Your dad says these jokes all the time? He sounds like a who? Is he an owl? What an owl they would say about Mr. Corbin. What an owl. good dad joke every once in a while. Can't overdo the dad joke. I just like a good pun or a good turn of phrase. Something I generally like. I don't know if I put that in the dad joke category. I, I like a good pun though. I'm always a fan of a good pun. A good turn of phrase, a good, uh, a good segue to another topic, I like those. All right, Alex Bregman leads us off and we've got Adam Hazley for the Phillies, Brian Crouch. There's Andrew McCutcheon, Ben Intendi, Raking Rookies, Atomic. We got Taylor Trammell for the Red Legs. That'll be for Rick and the Reds. His Reds. And there's Alex Fiedo. Red Legs, they did that because uh, they did not they did that in the sixties if I remember correctly. Temporarily kind of re-nicknamed themselves so as to not be associated with communism. I think we were, we as Americans were more afraid of communism back then than we are now. Trevor Rogers, Miami Marlins. That goes to John Mortellaro. There you go, John. Ninety-seven out of ninety-nine. Nice. It's about how fast this fastball can go. A little bit. Cody Bellinger. I think all those Cody Bellinger cards and stuff will add up to out of two fifty. Rolled as Chapman for the Yankees. Brian Crouch. There's Aaron Judge. And Lucas Urseg. I don't think I've seen him, a lot of him, in all the cases we've done. Brew Crew. That goes to Alex Donnelly. And Bryce Harper at the end right there. All right, next box. Let me sleeve these up too. All right, next box. Yeah, Corbin, you, you may want to. How old are you, Corbin? When do you turn 12? Joke writing may not be in your future, my friend. Kevin Crouch liked it. He got one fan.
I guess I guess this was the uh, the first inaugural night of open mic night. <laughs> and I don't know if Corbin's gonna be asked back to the stage next week for open mic night. See the whole the whole this whole night is unraveling already. Clark Schmidt with the Yankees, Brian. Uh, no, I'm, I don't. I don't. I don't know if I don't know if if, uh, if Corbin Corbin joke hour is working. I don't know if that's going to work. We may have to delete that from the programming, from the show. <laughs> this segment is not working, Corbin. This is not getting us ratings. We may have to go a different direction, my friend. Nice Anderson Espinoza. One of the big names traded over from the Red Sox. That goes to the Padres now. Gabriel. Nice one, Gabe. This guy's supposed to be a big deal. I don't know if you help my sales go up. You might actually be driving away customers, Corbett. So let's not let's not get ahead of ourselves, my friend. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Dansby Swanson, 38 out of 50. That goes to the Bravos, Nino. Nino's been hitting nicely with this Bowman's best stuff. So Corbin, when do you turn 12? You didn't answer that question. Next year? Next month? Logan Warmoth for the Blue Jays. Victor Z. Nice one, Victor. And this is the atomic mirror image. And that will be randomized separately. Okay, so you're about 12. Okay, gotcha. All right. Dansby was nice. I feel like Dansby Swanson is going to be fine next season. I think, you know, he's a little young. I, got, I think he got called up, maybe rushed through the minors a little too quickly, called up a little too early. But I think he'll be, he should be fine. Good luck, everybody. We're about halfway through this break. Um, huh. I think we may have time uh, for one quick break after this, because I think this will be over in about 15, 20 minutes. I'm trying to think what we can do tonight before we call it a night. We can squeeze this Leaf Metal Draft Baseball in. So if you want to try that, go for it. Or NT uh, Collegiate, yeah, we can do that. NT Collegiate would be a fun break to do. That's an easy break to fill, and that doesn't take very long. That's another break that only takes like five, 10 minutes. We can squeeze that in before the night is through. Because I feel like by the time I finish this break, put this break away, you know, clean everything up, and get ready for the next break, um, it'll, we'll have time for like a quick one box break. Maybe something on 10 is an option too. Leaf Metal would be cool. NT National Treasures Collegiate would be cool. Um, 
the best way to influence other people is to just buy into that brig. Don't ask other people, hey, like, who wants to do... No, just straight up buy the spot. Just be like, yo, I bought this. I bought that spot. What next? 91 out of 150. Mackenzie Gore. That is for Gabriel with the Padres. Nice. So that'll help, especially when we're running out of time. That'll help. Uh, Keston Hiuda. He played at UC Irvine. They're the Ant Eaters. Brew Crew. That goes to Alex Donnelly. There you go, Alex. There he is. There's Mitch Keller for the Pirates. This goes to Rick and the Pirates. There you go, Rick. There's Willie Calhoun. That's a Rangers edition. He was a former Dodgers prospect. Dylan Cousins for the Phillies. Nice. Brian Crouch with the Phillies. Oh, nice, James. Yeah, hopefully. We haven't pulled any big Red Sox hits yet. But there's still plenty of autographs to go. Speaking of burgers, there's Jake Burger. 83 out of 250. That goes to the White Sox, Adam Phillips. And Jordan Montgomery for the Yankees. I don't think we've seen a Jordan Montgomery yet. Uh, that goes to Brian and the Yankees. There are your four autographs. There's the last bit. Three boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. You see yourself, Corbin? I see. Corbin, if you really want to be, if you really want to be a jokester, you gotta have pretty th thick skin. <laughs> have thicker skin than that. All right, third to last box. Shane Boz, that's for the Pirates, Rick. <laughs> Michael Colucci might wanna buy that from you, Rick. He's been looking for this for like the last few breaks. Raking rookies. Bregman, Altuve, and Quinton Holmes for the Indians. That goes to TJ. There you go, TJ. Some color on this. 92 out of 99. This is a new auto. I haven't seen this. Joe Adele. Nice. Hello. 
It's me. Um, Mike Koontz with the Joe Adele. This mirror image will be randomized separately because it's numbered. 37 out of 50. Mike Trout and Austin Beck, are they really getting comparisons? Wow. All right. So that'll be a randomizer between the Angels, Mike Koontz, and the A's, TJ. Brendan McKay to 99, 90 out of 99 for the Rays. That'll be for Garza. And another Trevor Rogers. T Raj. Old T Rod. I don't know if they call him T. I don't think they call him T Rod. John Mortolaro. Nice. He went to Carl. Sorry, Carlsbad, New Mexico. Huh? I've always wanted to go to the Carlsbad Caverns. Carlsbad Caverns. I hear it's fun. If you like caves, there's McCutcheon, out of two fifty. Yeah, there's no monochrome yet. The case it has it we haven't seen yet, Gabriel. All right. Four more autographs to go. Good luck, everybody. <laughs> Relax, Corbin. Relax. You're fine. You gotta figure, you gotta, you're hanging with grown-ups here. Eight autographs to go. Good luck, everybody. Like Gabriel mentioned, we have not seen the um, we have not seen the monochrome yet. This break is brought to you by Aquafina. Delicious. Aquafina. Cool, refreshing, purified drinking water. Pure water. Perfect taste for a perfect case break. Aquafina. All right, on to the second box. Mackenzie Gore for the Padres. Nice one, Gabriel. That's a, that's a third overall pick. I think, something like that. Top five, definitely, this year, 2017. There's the Boz again, 26 out of 150 in Keston Huda. What Gabriel's really looking for is that Cody Bellinger. Or Alex Verdugo, what about this? Nine out of 75. Gabriel with our Dodgers. Nice, Alex Verdugo, 9 out of 75. Might see him start playing every day this season. It's a possibility. It's got a good chance. 
that insert auto might mean a uh, a bonus auto. There's Carlos Correa at a 250. There's Tanner Hawk. Tanner Hawk for the Red Sox, James Otten. There you go, James, a little something. And Brendan McKay. Wow. Pitching edition of Brendan McKay is your case hit. Nice. Tampa Bay Rays, that'll be for Garza. 29 out of 125. That is strong. This is a strong box. And a burger. A delicious, delicious burger to top things off. White Sox, that goes to Adam Phillips. He's got a nice autograph. Nice. And Brent Honeywell, 46 out of 50. Easy, folks. It's a family show. Brent Honeywell, Tampa Bay Rays. Garza with that one, too. Nice box. All right. Last box. Good luck, everybody. Now, like I said, we do have time for like a quick one box break after this, but I don't see any orders coming in. So maybe this is it, folks. If this is it, I'll be back tomorrow, three o'clock Pacific, six o'clock Eastern. I see Connor with an order. But our last four autographs, so there's still a lot of autos to go. Still four autographs to go. Good luck, everybody. This is Bowman's Best, pick your team eight. The next one is in the store. That'll go off tomorrow on a Friday. Join us then. And then we'll see how we'll see how uh, ten o'clock joke hour goes tomorrow. I don't know if it went very well today. I'll come. I'll write some more stuff. Tice needs some Mariners before we go to bed. Kevin Crouch thinking maybe an Aaron Judge auto that'll make Dad happy. We haven't seen any Aaron Judge autos in in all almost eight full cases now. It's like 7.7 7 cases. Seven and seven boxes. This is box eight. It's like it's like innings pitched. So in all 7.7 7 boxes, no Aaron Judges. Will this be the one? We'll see. I don't see a redemption. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see what we got. The autograph, should I hide all the autos? Should I just be like, we'll just do all the autos last? We got uh, Cito Sanchez, eight out of 50. Nice one for the uh, Phillies. That'll go to Brian Crouch. I'm gonna make sure I didn't miss a numbered card. I thought I did. I did not. And that's the auto right there. All right, four autos, here we go. First one is Christopher Seiss. I think I've said it differently every break I've done. 
uh, his last name. Alex Donnelly with the Rangers. Behind Corey Seager, behind door Corey Seager is Ryan Mountcastle. I think a lot of people remember him from Bowman Draft a year or two ago. Ryan Mountcastle, one of my favorite names in the hobby, Mountcastle. Like a mountain and a castle put together. That's strong. EA Sports, it's in the game with the Ryan Mountcastle. Behind Dansby Swanson is Lourdes Guriel Jr. for the Blue Jays. Victor Z. Nice. Victor with an autograph at the very, very end. That's Yuli's brother. And no redemption. Last but not least is D.L. Hall. The one per case D.L. Hall for the Orioles. That goes to Eric with the O's. And there you have it, boys and girls. The last four autos of Z-Box. Eight cases in the books. Thanks very much, everyone. Let's do some randomizers. First, we have a left-right randomizer. Then we have the atomic. Then we have the parallel that was actually numbered. All right, so we need one, two, three, four. All right, so let's flip over this screen for the left and right. We've got Diamondbacks and Nationals. We got Angels and A's. And let's figure out who gets these right here. Sort by column A. Alex, you bought at least two spots. You've got an entry. So does Brian, so does Eric, so does Gabriel, so does John, so does Garza, Gallucci, Mike Koontz, Rick has a shot, so does TJ, and Tyrone. There's only 11 names on this one. Let's get that these guys in here too. All right, let's roll the dice for all the lists. Good luck. Four and a one. Five times. Five easy times. Left, right, first. One, two, three, four, and five. Left side. So on these just regular cards right here, the regular mirror image cards, the left side will get them. Four and a one. Five times. Four. Diamondbacks National. That's the atomic refractor. The one per case atomic refractor. Two, three, four, and five. After five times, go to the Nationals. That'll be for Tyrone. There you go, Tyrone. You can thank Victor Robles for that. All right, and last but not least is the Mirror Image 37 out of 50. Once again, four to one, five times for this. One, two, three, four. Fifth and final time, name on top, gets a spot in Transcendent Baseball on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Five, Brian Crouch. There you go. Brian Crouch with a spot in Transcendent Baseball. It's a $155 value. Congrats, sir. Thank you very much, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. That was Bowman's Best, number eight. We will see you next time. No, we won't see you next time. I forgot to do this. Angels A's. I was like, I know I missed one. 37 out of 50. So you get the transcendent spot after five times. Let's do this really quick. Four and a one, Angels A. Sorry, Angels A's. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. Flips to the A's. That goes to TJ. So TJ, little consolation prize right here. 37 out of 50, mirror image, Mike Trout and Austin Beck. And there you have it, folks. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. Now we're done. Eight boxes of Bowman's Best Baseball in the books for break eight. It was great. We'll see you tomorrow, jazbeeshobbyland.com.